So I've got a Bosch dishwasher. It's about six years old. And um, got this problem where the cycle just keeps kind of resetting itself or, or, or um, changing the amount of time left in the cycle during the middle of the wash. It might get down to 30 minutes left or 20 minutes and then you see 50 all of a sudden. Um, or maybe it gets down to one minute and it just stays stuck at one minute. Just a quick note before we get started. Be sure to unplug any appliance before working on it. It's just a reminder. Thank you. And then also that for this particular job, we're going to have to slide the unit out away from the cabinet. About uh, one foot is all you need, and uh, you'll see why in a minute. So um, just be careful when um, uh, unscrewing it from the, the cabinet. The issue is often solved by opening the door during the cycle, reclosing it and pushing firmly, and then the cycle picks up where it left off, or sometimes it'll uh, jump back about 20 or 30 minutes and then it will actually finish. So the problem is related to the door latch. Up at the top here, um, not sensing that the door is actually shut, and I, I think it's just a matter of the latch being worn out. But before replacing the latch, I was told by a, um, a friend, a plumber, that I could take this bar at the top and actually bend it downward just to put some pressure on it and bend it downward just a little bit. You can unscrew these four star screws um, and then just ever so slightly bend it downward because sometimes this will help to keep uh, enough pressure on uh, the latch so that it will um, sense that the door is actually shut correctly. But in my case, that's not working. There's a, actually a slight bend to it downward and it's still just not continuing to keep the, the latch from operating. I figured it was time to order some new parts. So I got a new bracket and a new latch like this. Um, while I was at it ordering parts, I also took the opportunity to get a new uh, door gasket, which I'm going to change later. All right, so with the switch, I'm sorry, with the uh, the latch, I'm going to take this one out, and uh, here's the new one. You can see there's a bit of rust on the old one, where obviously the new one is clean. And also, um, when I maneuver the latch into the open position, um, and then set it closed again, I notice the, um, the new latch is a bit tighter. So maybe it's just going to hold better. I can't do it with one hand while I'm while I'm uh, with the camera. There, so I've opened it, and um, it took two hands to do that. So it's definitely a tighter um, latch. And then this is um, the closed position. So be careful when putting this on, because uh, if it's in the closed position and then you try to close the door, uh, it's it's not going to give. And in fact, uh, you can break the um, the screw that holds this this latch onto the uh, the housing you can break the um the housing where the screw fits which is what i did so don't make the mistake i did make sure the latch is in the open position when you install it um, if the door is open of course all right i've got the new latch in place i've got the bracket um, tightened down with those star bits screws and um we should be ready for a test run, but I'm going to go ahead and um, put the, uh, the seal in place. It's actually this one right here, um, because this one's just worn out, and that moisture can't be helping with, with any of these issues. In fact, I've seen a little bit of leakage while the unit was running, so I'm going to go ahead and replace that. All right, I've got the new gasket installed. That was really easy to do. It's called the door seal. And uh, you can find a video for that pretty easily. But um, the unit's being tested right now. And I can tell you that when I pull slightly back on the door uh, while I'm testing it, it, uh, it still holds the cycle. Whereas with the old latch, when I pulled back just slightly, um, it would stop the cycle. So it was definitely a lot more sensitive um, because of the weaker latch, uh, I suppose, and because of the um, because of the older bracket here, 
So with those new parts, uh, so far so good. And with the new door seal, um, hopefully that's ho holding a tighter um, seal as well and a tighter connection to everything. So we'll see how it goes and I'll, I'll uh, update this post if, uh, if anything changes. Thank you for watching. All right, it's two weeks later and I promised an update. So I just wanted to let you know that it's been working perfectly ever since we changed those parts. So the new latch, the new bracket, and honestly, the new door seal might have been part of the uh, what, what helped it to fix it because, um, as I said before, there was, there was a little bit of leakage and you never know, maybe that door seal was, uh, was just not helping to, to keep the unit um, closed properly. But either way, it's working now. I wanted to let everyone know. So thanks and please hit the subscribe button if this was helpful.